Hi, my earth signs. What it do, what it do, what it do. It's your favorite, the one and only extra love coming through to see what's popping with you. What up, my babies? What up, my Tauruses, my bullies, and my bosses? What up, Virgo, the bag, Hermes, the bag? And what up, Capricorn, my better half? OG flip sides. I love you with my highest love. Namaskar. How are you on this fine day, my baby? Right? So, as you can tell, we've been grouping the readings by the elements. As in, you're in your own element and somebody is not. Right, my baby? A key phrase for you is going to be be still, right, my baby? I hear when it rains, it pours. And I keep seeing Morton salt, right, my baby? So I see a lot of family members have been using salt and black salt for protection. It always dispels any type of negativity. Negativity cannot survive around salt. I see you kicking it old school, my baby, right? I see you being still. I also see a lot of my sea stars getting, like, alterations on clothing. And I see, like, a lot of pins, like something's being sewn together. And you keep fidgeting, keep fidgeting, you know what I'm saying? I also see hair being done. As far as men fidgeting in the chairs, I see like young ones, like for their first haircut and stuff like that. And some getting their last haircut. I also see um, young ones, young goddesses getting their hair done, stuff like that. So I just keep saying, be still, be still. Or it can be as far as peace, be still, or peace of peace. Because we also have a video called Peace of Peace, and I was led to remind you to go back through the paid playlist, you know, extra love, type in Peace of Peace. Peace as in a slice, P-I-E-C-E, -E, of peace as in peace, right? <laughs> or like, um, that's very important to you, being the earth sign, right, my baby? My bullies and my bosses, the bags and the better halves. Your peace, you know what I'm saying? I see you're not for no gain. Definitely not no game. You're not the one. You're the other one. Right, my baby? And I see that you have successfully merged your higher and your lower self. Unity and joy is what you're experiencing. And if you are not, you soon will be. But I really feel like you are experiencing now. I see a lot of family members have finally had a chance to take advantage of restorative and recuperative type sleep right and I see that you learned that happiness comes unexpectedly someone is learning you can't plan happiness you can't plan satisfaction you can't plan success or anything like that it comes unexpectedly right and I keep hearing for you is get yours while you can like you're on top of the wheel you know what I'm saying you're basically at your final destination or someone is or, or like a journey ends right my baby I see your my earth sign definitely being still I see you really know what BS stands for, right? Not bullshit. But as in 
be still. Every time your antennas are up, you know, much like this one. <laughs> one of these. Every time your antennas is up, you know, it's some bullshit. But for you especially, it just feels, see this, like my antennas is up. <laughs> like every time your nose itches or you sneeze out of the blue, that's your boundaries being breached. Alert, alarm. You know what I'm saying? And, um, I see, well, this, you know, I got some beautiful, beautiful family members. Y'all out here, all of them, she, just, just, uh, sugar maple, right? One of y'all poppers, because clearly y'all out here making it pop. Y'all got six, no, seven cars that popped out. <laughs> you had a lot to say, right, my baby? I see you're... You saying no more politicking. Because I see you really don't like surprises. You really don't like being blindsided. You really don't like to find out anything unless it's from the horse's mouth. You're the type of person that goes directly to source. Fuck a middle man or a master plan. You go directly to source because you see the sweetness in life, right, my baby? And I see you it's, You are eternally full of thanks and eternally full of greats. Grateful and thankful, right, my baby? You know to make each day count, right, my baby? I see you got a lot of wisdom, my baby. You picking up these keys. I'm trying to tell you, blacksmith should be... One of your hustles. We definitely got, I think, three locksmiths. Well, there's really more if you want to be spiritual, but actually in the physical. We actually have three locksmiths in our family. And, like, you know, always, you know, on earth, you've always been seeking the truth. You know, what was blowing me away about my family is y'all getting heavy hit energy. You know what I'm saying? Whoa, 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 right? Goddesses and gods. Look what you pulled. Motherfucking star card. My baby. <laughs> I love it. You know what I'm saying? Look at you. Dig you here. Right, my baby. You know what I'm saying? All oh, because you weathered the storm in the search for truth. My baby. See, look at this arm. It may be windy. You still remain upright and fair, you know what I'm saying, not for no games, tapping in the vine, definitely love nature, definitely love nature, so the message I'm still getting for you besides be still, because you know that's your bullshit alert, every time you sit, you sense bullshit, right, antennas be up, nose itch, ringing, foot moving, all of that, twitches and twerks, right, you know it's some bullshit in the game because I find it awfully strange. This was your card, right? Make each day count, right? So guess what song kept popping in my mind? And if it ain't the most apropos for you right now, my baby, I don't know what song is. <laughs> you ready for it? <laughs> it's all about the Benjamins, baby. Mm. Remember I did it? What you wanted? Shot callers. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? It's all about the Benjamins, right, my baby? Because I'm also hearing another song. And it's called Do the Math, Baby. Do the Math, Baby. Because you make every day count. I mean, each day count, right? So if you're counting and you're making things count, that means you're adding shit up. As in, you're getting the pieces to the puzzle and everything's put together. You might be missing one or two keys but you know you'll see stars here to give them to you right my baby because life is about to be sweet for you my baby you were never meant to experience anything but of joy and glee and 
happiness and just love, right? And that's the truth. Anything else is the illusion. I'm trying to tell you. It's true, girl. We're going to keep pulling it. But the truth is, you were never meant for life. Where they do that at? How could that be? You know what I'm saying? When you see who your daddy is. The I am. And we are. Hello. The numbers. Okay, okay let me tell you this. Brother. The numbers as a unit, as a collective, definitely for our family, is one, two, three, four. For you specifically, it was the numbers 19, which you know is the star, 33, which is the Ascendant Masters. You know what I'm saying? Definitely tapped into your cosmic and galactic family. They're walking with you. You know what I'm saying? Definitely holding your hand. I want to hold your hand. I want to hold your hand. That's what you were saying the whole time. You were telling someone that, they were telling you that. That's where you were telling the divine. Because guess what, my baby? I see it was a lot of nights, a lot of cold nights you experienced, a lot of change. A lot of change. You experienced the weather, the ups and downs, my baby, the highs and the lows. And you see the light. You, you walk on faith, my baby. You know what it means to walk on faith. Because you walk on water. This flow of love. Unconditional love. To, with, and for unconditional love, my baby. And that's, that's you. So I see your motto is embrace change. Right, my baby? Even if you don't know what each day brings. You live each day to the fullest. You do what makes your heart happy. You do what brings you glee. Because that's the word I'm on, glee. Right? And you, you see how to make every situation you in. You savor the sweetness of every situation. Good, bad, happy, or sad. You know what I'm saying? Everything is a learning experience out here, my baby. And I see you know the truth. That's why you're experiencing peaks of joy up, up in the way. Right, my baby? So for you, I see you don't politic. You don't tee hee 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 or chuckle, chuckle, chuckle with none of these motherfuckers. Right? Because you ain't in for no surprises. You don't like surprises. Getting back to what we were talking about. You really don't like for nobody to spring nothing on you. You really don't like to find out nothing second hand. And you for sure, for sure don't appreciate when in the divine realm have to come to you with truths. You know, because I could have swore, you know, the time elapsed. For these illusionists to reveal their duplicity, right? So now karma's out here. And I see you're grateful that you're on this side of karma, right? Definitely getting assistance from the eighth dimension. It's just like series and fortune is out here, my baby. I see you're waking up. You're waking up and to who's really running the show. This is all you do all day. Sing the praises of the most highs. You know. Sing how good the most high has been in your life. No matter what. No matter what, my baby. You have a friend. You know what I'm saying? I just keep... You got a friend. Because <laughs> you really do, right? So I was prompted, because I keep hearing all about the Benjamin's baby, right? <laughs> so let me tell you the funny little thing about that. Every time I hear that song, right? All about the Benjamin, right? I think of Benjamin Franklin, and then instantly it's like that founder's type of energy. 
the originalities, the original OG, OGs, the builders of all of this shit, right? So, like I said, you guys are harnessing a lot of energy, right? And I've seen it's been a long time coming. A lot of our family members have gotten it out of the mud. Meaning they have clinked up their life, tower to everything, and started from the bottom, building each brick, working each layer of their foundation to something that can last and stand the test of time, right, my baby? I see you see the wisdom in tapping in and getting information from your highest self, the most high, right, my baby? And you know it's a cold, cold world out here. And there's a lot of people that operate out this root chakra. So I was told to explain the type of energy that we're in. This is like five. Okay. This is the year 2021. Supposedly, right? So you know that's five. Two plus two plus one is five, right? This is five of wands energy as in wands signifies for sure what's going on in the spiritual realm. One second, family. <laughs> one second. Excuse me. Grandson turning over. Thank you, family. I appreciate it. I just see the young gods are finally making their voices heard. How about that? That's the synchronicity for our family. See, five of wands energy is like Saturn, right? Or what goes down, what happens here on Earth, right? So the lesson always with Saturn's are boundaries and structure, right? So, basically in like oracles or tarot, five of wands would be like strife. It's no um, unity. Everybody want to be a chief and don't nobody want to be an Indian. It's like no unity, it's all willy-nilly, it's all like fucked up, right? So usually, I just feel like we're going to pull that card, but usually what five of wands means, it's a good opportunity to come up type of energy. Like if you trying to build some wealth or currency or health and abundance, it's not really a bad card because it's basically working with the four elements in spirit. See, that's the real test. It's real test. Are you in or not? Right? Because we're all being tested, right? But, like, I'm feeling like a lot of Saturn and Leo energy. See, with that type of energy, which is what you're harnessing, right, my baby? It's courage and creativity. Definitely royals out here. It's courage and creativity, right? You know, basically, do you want to discover the mystery? Do you really want to find out who's the lucky charm? Are you willing to put in the work? Because, you know, we're all being tested out here in school in these spiritual streets. And we on the playground, right? So for those who rise to the occasion 
and put in the work to build solid foundations, you know, especially when they're unassisted, they always get ace of wands or a new spark, a new creativity, a new skill, something like that, right? Whereas in the one that doesn't cooperate or the one that's the source of power struggles and strife and disagreements, like a lot of litigation, energy, or whatever, they usually end up with ten of wands, right? Because it's basically like the, the universe, the divine realm gives you a gift and you just shit on it and you just spit on it and no matter what, kicking or screaming, you just ain't going to do what you ain't going to do. So the universe basically be like, trick no good, right? Like this mission is bigger than you. And this mission is bigger than what each individual can take on on their own. So, you know, it's strength in numbers. That's what five of wands really mean. Strength in numbers. T teamwork makes the um, dream work. Right? But usually when you have that, as I see, my baby, because, you know, you do the math. You add shit up. You figure shit out, Inspector Gadget, but not for real. That's who was messing with you. You know what I'm saying? You're more like I spy. You know what I'm saying? Because you espy with your eye, right, my baby? That determination and just stick with itness will take you a long way, right, my baby? Take you a long way. And I know it feels for some of our family members that it just always seems like it gets worse before it gets better. And that may be true, but you can find comfort and you can find solace and you can continue to step out on faith because you know that the hardest part of your journey is over. So that's why I got back to your numbers. Because, like I said, the collective was... One, two, three, four, you got 19 and 33, which means for sure the Ascended Masters are walking with you. Triple threes, five, two, five, and triple fives change. Three things are changing. Because see, I definitely feel like you haven't been getting any sleep. Any, you, yeah, you may have been, how about this? What good is sleep if it's your soul that's tired, my baby? What good is sleep if it's your soul that's tired? You know what I'm saying? You got tired of your soul being tired. This person has two. But I see you make each day count. You do everything out of love, my baby. Right. See, because in the past, you were preparing for a journey for a lifetime, or in this lifetime, right, my baby? The journey to take you home again, right? Because you're pulling a lot of hangman energy, right? So the hangman in Oracle and Tarot is usually symbolic to a spiritual initiation where you have a symbolic death and resurrection. So you go you could go through something that you think is going to kill you, shatter your psyche. That's the most devastating thing ever to be born again. Because I'm kind of getting like that Phoenix Rising energy. You know, like Jean Grey, you know what I'm saying? Things. It's crazy, right? But see, you be still. I see a lot of our family members, you know, they like sugar cane. And that's the truth. They used to chew sugar cane. <laughs> you know, a lot of, lot of kids did it. Yeah, this is beautiful. Beautiful. I see you're a princess or a prince among men. Definitely a royal. Definitely cosmic and galactic heritage out here galactic princess and galactic princesses for sure you know that slow and steady um 
wins, wins the race. Um, reminded to um, remind you, <laughs> right, to go back through our playlist and look for one of four, right? Because I, you know, the theme for these videos is a few good men, as in a few good ones. And I see that you are, you are one out of four. That's really who you say you are. That really is about what you say you're about. They really walk it like they talk it. You know what I'm saying? It's beautiful. And I see like what's causing a, a stir in your life is you not stuck in the matrix. You can actually think for yourself. You know how to think for yourself. You know, that's strange. It's just, it's not, it, you know, it's definitely odd out here, my lady. Definitely odd. I see you got a lot of silent wisdom. I see you just sit back and watch people play themselves. Another family member that knows the riddle of Spanx. Right, my baby? So, like I said, this is a five-year, five of wands energy year. You know what I'm saying? And this is beautiful if you have divine unions that work together, that are disciplined and focused, you know what I'm saying, and follow the rainbow. They follow the promises that their father gave them, their mother gave them. You know what I'm saying? Definitely feeling like a lot of um, um, mathematicians, journeymen contractors, you know, independent workers, you know what I'm saying, definitely working with spirit, definitely walking with spirit, you know, five of wands energy is good for building, so I think that was it that I got, no more politicking, no more surprising, and I see the divine realm have cut you off from irritants. I see something has been bugging you. Right, my baby? Something has been bugging you. So let's get it. Bottom of the deck is the world card. Yeah, out here in this world, you're showing others how to make each day count. Dig you. Hank, didn't I tell you, Hank, my energy. Definitely spiritual initiation. You know what love is. And I see you sticking with love. Lover's card successfully merge your higher and lower self. Definitely is in divine union. You see the light. Definitely see the light, my, my baby. You see you're in a spiritual union. Definitely see the stars. Definitely in your fortune. See, this is an eight-pointed star. This is series. One more second, family. One more second. Probably. Okay, fam, you know what I thought was strange, was apropos for you too, is that he's teething, he's cutting teeth, and I see you are too, right, my baby? <laughs> right, very fortunate, my baby, very, very fortunate. Yeah, someone's watching their happiness sail right on their way, my baby. Yeah, I see you be still. 
the divine realm, your cosmic and galactic family is going to always peep you to what's going on. They're going to always reveal it to you. And that's the truth. And for that, I see you are eternally grateful. And that's why you don't have no problem with showing up. Ooh. Knight of Pentacles. Wow. Yeah, definitely. Being removed from a Knight of Pentacles. Somebody that was very, very close to you, right, my baby? Mm -mm -mm. Anything else, there? I'm sorry, family. That was real. How are y'all doing this evening? Woo, woo, woo. Right. Wow. Wowzy. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Under the Knight of Pentacles. Ace of Wands reverse. You know what I'm saying? Some of their currency has been taken away. This is karma. That spark of creativity has been taken away. And someone's been forced to carry their own burden. You know what I'm saying? Before they were bringing them to you. See, they was on their way. <laughs> right? Now, I see, your heart is cold. And they're being forced to carry it. Definitely a separation. Higher friend, you know. Y'all always got to make an appearance in y'all. <laughs> Read, right, my baby? Right, my bullies and my bosses. Yes, I see that you were wise that someone was trying to kill your creativity and the burden you. Definitely, you know, getting the guidance and the wisdom about marital sex. And it looks like it all stems from a victory that you had. You were definitely doing something that you loved and you created and it was like someone was envious of that. They weren't thankful and grateful. And they definitely wasn't making each day count with you, my baby. Yes. Man. Fool card. I see you're on your way onto your new journey. You dropped these burdens, my baby. No new beginning. Your innocence is being protected on all sides. Ooh, past the deck. <laughs> Talk about. Wow, this is a lot of cards. I don't know. We gonna shut them. Y'all definitely have something to say, spirit. Somebody saying something. Let's get it. You know, I just feel like you know what I'm saying. You're in Queen of Pentacles energy. You're definitely in the star energy, but. You know what I'm saying? Definitely a queen of pentacles. You're going to be successful in your endeavors. Your new career, your new skill. Gift, talent, and ability. And it just seems like someone's covetous. They're coveting the sweetness of your life. I just, I just feel like you're a beautiful being. You're happy. You already know you're protected. You see that you're protected. You have witnessed that the divine realm move for you. Yes. I see you working on a new skill. Definitely working on a new skill. <laughs> Hard at work, right? Why you're hard at work. Someone's hard at work behind your back. While you're working with spirit, teamwork make the dream work. Remember, these almost done. Five of man. Someone's trying to take the sweetness out of your life. This is crazy. Let's get it. I see you're thankful for the truth. 
Even if it was bittersweet, come on, baby. Even if it was bittersweet. I see you abhor lies. You can't be around lies or deceptions. You rocking with the truth squad, I see. No, I was also prompted to tell you. Ooh. Another reversal card. Y'all ain't on the plane for a while. Beautiful, bossy, sucking like look, 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 look. Suited and booty, right? You know what I'm saying? But I see someone treated you less than the beautiful being you are. And this is what they're experiencing. Because, you know, out here in these streets, it's spiritual. I see you do spiritual work, and you love it. Whatever you're doing, you tap into the most high. So I'm prompted to share what I shared with a few family members the other day. Right? Like, when you get thoughts, right? When you think of something, have a new idea, you know, something like that. Like... Do you really think, well, I know you know this story, but, like, do people think they're thinking the thought, or is it the most high sprinkling it, right? So whatever you feel compelled to, whatever makes your soul sing the song that is you, as in song, singing the song, right, of you, that's what God led you to do. Fuck if another person understands it, nine times out of ten, you don't understand it. We as a collective don't understand. But clearly, for you to be led to where you are, for certain things to pique your curiosity, clearly, that is where you're supposed to be. Right, my baby? I see you're thankful and grateful for your relationship with the divine. Definitely. Whoa. Man, all these reversal cards. This is really the Ten of Cups, but this is this is how it used to be. See the rainbow? Follow the rainbow to the Lucky Charm. That's all you had to do. Ten of Cups. Oh, wait a minute. I'm going to fuck it up. Ten of Cups. What? This is like the end game. The step before the end game, right, my baby? But somebody watched it. Walk on by. Yes, it's crazy. That's what spirit tells you. When you're thankful and grateful, this was mm 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 justice card out here. Woo 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 woo, my baby. Mm mm mm. So you found balance. They, the divine will help you find balance. Okay, one more card to wrap this up. We don't go around if you don't understand, my baby. Yes. Oh, devil card. <laughs> One's to make appearance. It ain't pop out. I wanted to. Yes. Title card. By my deck. Right. Ooh, ooh. You know who made an appearance? Right? He's, these magical illusionists are out here. The magician. Right? The magician. Three of Wands. That you used to give joy to who didn't give it back to you because their back was turned towards you. They didn't give you joy. They didn't make you feel beautiful. You, this is one, one of your greatest teachers in this lifetime. For they taught you how to truly, truly love you. Right, my baby? To be prepared for anything. Anyone can turn their back on you. This is a cold world. Fill your own cup. So after they, you know, turned their back on you and had you all in, didn't I tell you, like, five, five energy, five is the number five energy is challenges that lead to expansion, challenges that lead to spiritual expansion and spiritual growth. This is how you were feeling, all fucked up and outcast, you know what I'm saying? A misfit, everything you do is just, oh, and it was affecting your health. This is a, it took half of your life away. Ten of Pentacles is what the mission is, right, my baby? 
They took five of them away, and it affected your health. Right? I see you make it pop. You make each day come. I'm talking about you are a ball of fun. Make sure it's dead. Oh, it was upside down. I'm about to say it. Empress card. Divine feminine. Oh, here. Peep in the play. What can get by the Empress? She rules all four elements. Air, fire, water, earth. She's a master. A master out here, my baby. Badass being. No one does it better. Title card, Empress. There's nobody out here like you. Fucking with the Empress. Nobody. Quit. My God. You're the mother. Man, dick is here with you. Mask and the feminine. This is like a feat unto itself. Okay? You know what I'm saying? You're the motherfucking queen of pentacles. The, the Empress and the badass being. This is all you. This is all your energy, my baby. Definitely all your energy. Ain't nobody... Bad as mofo being. Title card, that means you on your ding, you tap in, you're doing every motherfucking thing you need to be doing. And that's why you're the empress. You were placed here. You're definitely harnessing divine feminine energy with the greatest of ease, my baby. Definitely tapped in the spirit, and they definitely look how she's looking like. Anybody can get it. Wow. Money making family member, money making bullying boss, right? You know what I'm saying? Money making the bag, because I know Virgo is all in this mix, in the bag, right? And my flip side is my Capricorn. Look at the type of energy you harnessing. Strictly because you got this silent wisdom. You know who feeds your soul. You know who the most I is in your life. I see that's why you keep quiet. <laughs> yeah, I just keep hearing this phrase I always say. You may be s small in stature, but you're big in the spiritual realm. How about that? Let me get a few more cards. This is beautiful. Yes, my baby. Yes, yeah, definitely cutting your teeth out here. Definitely not how to get it in. This was a test, my baby. To see if you operate out your lower root chakra or be all weak. Let motherfuckers continue to keep treading upon you. Remember, don't tread on me. Remember that phrase? Yeah, don't tread on me. Oh, someone to pop out and see what it was. Wow, this is a lot of freaking cards. Look at all these cards, man. <laughs> I'll just take the one that jumped out by itself. Let me shuffle. Ten of Pentacles. Somebody had it all. That's the truth. This is the end game. Ten of Pentacles. So somebody that you were uh a spouse, this is a pentacle. You know what I'm saying? This is like a family. Ten of Pentacles is a family. Someone juggled their family. Someone juggled the Queen of Pentacles, Empress, and Tiger Card. I've never seen this combination the, as long as I've been doing this, my baby. I mean, I just got to show you again. This shit is fucking phenomenal. My earth size, you are really out here in your bag being bullies and bosses. And you're definitely the better half. You down here running shit, my baby. Dig you here. Queen of Pentacles. Succulent. Got it out the mud. Self-made millionaire. If you're not, you're on your path to become one in this world. Motherfucking Emperors. This is the end game. This was one of your missions, my baby. This was one of your missions. Title card. Badass being. Come on now. This is a family. Ten of Pentacles is a, a unit. You know, children, grandchildren, pets, motherfucking 
everything's tied financially, health and wealth. It's all kind of cords. Ten cords, ten of pentacles. Now someone said that they turned their back on you. They didn't know who you were. I see you showed up as the Queen of Wands. Queen of Pentacles. So that means you were all in your feelings and all in your emotions. You were all in your mind and all in your emotions. That was the game. But I see you tapped into the spiritual, which was the wands, and you got on. You know what I'm saying? You're the Queen of Pentacles. Or you, you're the Queen of Pentacles, about to be the Empress if you're not. Justice out here. Couldn't make it up. Justice. Justice twice. Double karma, my baby. Somebody about to get double karma. They were sharp with you, but the divine realm sees everything. Laser-like focus. Just like you're focused on them, they're focused on you. You know what I'm saying? Real fair. Ooh, Queen of Cups. I'm telling you, they showed up. All Queen of Wands, Queen of Cups, Queen of Pentacles. Only thing left is Queen of Swords. That's the energy you had to be in. You're definitely a. I keep hearing Galactic Princess. My God. You look just like your mother. How about that? You have the same facial features. Same bone structure, everything. You know who your mother is. That's your justice. That's your justice, my baby. Someone's paternal dad is out here for them. Bringing them truth and justice. Your paternal uncle. Turn uncle has his eye on you, and you know who it is. I see you're forever grateful. They're one of your, um, they're on your spiritual team, here. Spirit guide. Top of the wheel, I couldn't make it up. This shit is beautiful, my baby. Wow, this will happen when you be still. This is what happens when you let the divine do it for you. But all this has been revealed to you. All the illusions. After you were a loving being. Right. Let's see what the ancestors say and then I'll get you up out of here, family. Be still. Messages coming in quick. Eight of Wands. Messages coming in quick. Hot and ready. Told you in this world, your highest self told you in this world. To always stay in contact with the divine. And they will always stay in contact with you. And if you let them take the lead, they're going to show you how to make each day count. How to make each day pop off for you. And they are. Ace of Cups. A new union. This is like daughter energy. Daddy's girl energy. New love. New love doing something that you love, right? You love doing something that you love. See, the devil card is out here. I see you see death, too. You see death, too. You definitely tap in and get that. Ooh, Ace of Wands. Ace of you got Spiritual realm came through for you. Ace of Wands, a new spark. They released emotional healing in your life. You got an ex because you extra like another family member's ex. A chance to change your destiny. Wow. That's what's up. You have a new spiritual practice. I see that. Queen of Cups again. Look at you. Always extending a helping hand. You think the divine realm wasn't going to move for you? Shake, rattle, and roll, my baby. Shake hmm. look good. <clears throat> and you got all the queens out here. Oh, you even came out your... Man, you done came out your trick bag. Queen of Swords. Do it look like she bullshitting? <laughs> this you. This the energy you in. This how you looking at motherfuckers. I told you you wasn't politicking with nobody. All that tee hee hee and chuckle chuckle chuckle. Fuck that fake shit. Very bright. You walking with the truth. 
Woo, my baby. Dig you. Right. Yes. This was somebody was doing to you. Trying to have you all in your mind. All worry and willy-nilly scatterbrained. All in a mental prison. You know, a hell somebody else created. Because notice like the fire isn't up at top his own head. It's down here. So somebody's trying to have you worry. They're wishing this on you, wishing you. They're fucking with your health. That's why you were let go. That's why you don't play no motherfucking games out here. Wow. Did you hear? You've been patient. I see you was patient. And Divine was patiently watching to see what someone was going to do. But you know what? Your dad is assisting you. You got this gift from your dad, right, my baby? How to walk away. How to walk away from the confusion. Mm -hmm. Did that. Right? Little fortune cards. Yeah, bottom of the card. This is you all day. And so you're sweet by the motherfucking emperor. The badass being in love. This is all you can do. See the divine realm helping this baby? Because you know you knew on your spiritual path. You a newbie, my baby. Definitely walking with the divine realm. Definitely chased to the bullshit. I'm telling you, Queen of Swords energy. Whoever this is, that you used to love. Oh, you ain't for no game. You know, you saw them mixing up a recipe for disaster. And you were patient. You, you saw this because, yeah, that, I noticed the pattern with our family. So, my bullies and my bosses, my Tauruses, you're like six, six days ahead with your revelation. So, like, you'll have something and six days later it'll come to pass. For my bags, the bag, Hermes, the bag, the Virgos, you see like 12 days ahead. And for my better halves, my flip sides, my Capricorn, you're like 18 days ahead. Sixes are going to be significant to you. See, now someone is in despair in that Ten of Wands energy. Because remember, they didn't want to assist you in this union. They didn't put in the work. So now they're all in despair. Seeing that you were patient with them and seeing, you know... How debilitating they were to your psyche. You know what I'm saying? This person, they're in despair because they feel like you see them as an enemy or a threat to you. And I see you called this out. You you told somebody they was a foe or a hoe or worn out threat. And that's why spirit moved you right on home. Because on your journey, you're finding a path to go home, right? Very gifted. Very gifted. I see a lot of spellcasters. A lot of spellcasters that work against energy vampires. And do protection spells and all of that. Man, that's a natural talent, gift, and ability. Run with that on your journey. You're definitely protected in this world. Soldier. You're protecting on all sides. Your innocency, all four sides. Your innocence of being protected. You got soldiers. You know what I'm saying? All the family members so far have been getting that card. Right. Definitely. You know, someone's. They're heartbroken that you see them as an enemy or a threat. And you know it's hard being beautiful. You, it's another card. Fortune series, we keep saying it, is out here. Fortunate. Yes, you are fortunate. Now you can be free and dance the song of your soul. Your song. To free. Free from the illusions, free from the bullshit. You know. And now someone is sorry for the misfortune they placed on you. You know. This is going to be prevalent. This is a lot of mental imprisonment. Trapped in their mind. Forgive yourself, family member. That was the message for someone. Forgive yourself. Forgive yourself. 
Yeah, you were definitely, they realized that you were healing them. And they were hurting you. And I see they're sick about it. Yeah. <clears throat> That's all I'm going to say. Yeshua Ben Panther. This is Jesus Christ consciousness in this day. Yes. I see you holler at your highest self in your imagination station. Right, my baby? Yeah, this is what you were told. Separate the wheat from the chaff if you wanted the ten of pentacles. And someone didn't. Someone didn't. Ten of pentacles twice. Right? And since they made you a choice and not an option, you were told to cut it off. Or they'll, the universe will cut it off for you. And it just is what it is. Spiritual law all day. Because at the end of the day, you are royal, my baby. Definitely a red one. And you're going to always know when there's some fake shit along your path. And I just keep hearing that you are safe, my baby. You're in a divine union with the Most High. And you're going to get your flowers. Why are you out here, my baby? You know what I'm saying? Someone was at a crossroads in a relationship. And I see they were being fake. And they woke up to sleeping bare on your path. Wow, divine masculine out here too. This would be like the emperor. Wow. I told you I felt that daddy's girl energy. Yeah, life is going to keep, flowers are going to be significant. You're going to get your flowers while you're here. For all that worry and strife and mental grief, I said, hell, you know, mental healing has been released in your life, my baby. You will have satisfaction. You will have fulfillment, my baby. I love you. I love you. I love you. The shepherd is here. No more politicking and no more surprises. Definitely. Moving on up, you have definitely ascended. This is beautiful. So I hear you're good. Anytime you feel bullshit or you call bullshit, just know the divine realm is whispering to you, screaming to you, be still. Watch this, or as in be still, let us take care of your light work. As in be still, sit down and meditate and marinate and get to know the most time your higher self. You know what I'm saying? You can never plan to be happy. Happiness comes unexpectedly. But as I said, you, you, you add it up. You're like a detective or something, a mathematician, statistician. Or something. But one thing I know is you know how to add, my baby. You definitely know how to add. And you definitely know how to make each day count. This phrase is going to be significant. So be still. Bullshit is when your bullshit alert is on. When your antenna is up. Right? And I see you were told to abandon someone. Who constantly fishes or constantly keeps trying to have you trapped in your mind. Yes. I love you, my family. It's all about the Benjamins, baby. It's all about the Benjamins, as in. Like I said, Benjamin Franklin as a founder. Like so, we got OG, OG, triple OG energy here. The whole game that is played in this realm is for energy, my baby. Energy, your life force, chi, prana, creativity, sexuality, and all that is beautiful, my baby. You're the empress. You're the motherfucking empress. This card is better than all these cards out here, except for Divine Masculine and Feminine. 
Because that's your cosmic and galactic family. But here on Earth, because that's what you rule, you know what I'm saying? You're beautiful. You embrace change. You listen to the most high. You always have a kind word to say. Always willing to assist. You know what I'm saying? Those. Definitely a healer. Definitely a healer. You know, someone is sad. Someone is sad. They can't be with you. And this is devastating to someone. You know, like I said, forgive yourself. No one's perfect. Everyone's ass has a crack in it. No, no judgment here, you know. And maybe sometimes a little stern on our family members, but it's always out of love because I see your higher self. If I'm just waiting on family members to see themselves how I see them, right? So, like I said, it's free will. You can either get the Ace of Wands or a new spark, a new zest for life. Or you can be burdened with the remorse and guilt and all those lower vibrational energies for not taking a chance. The wheel keeps on turning. Time waits for no man. But do it wait for a Superman? Does it wait for a superhero? Hmm. <laughs> That's the mystery. You know what I'm saying? Discover the mystery. Who's the lucky charm? Who's the lucky charm? I see you got the key to that riddle, my baby. Inks, my baby. You got the keys, the keys, the keys, my baby. Right. Yeah, people may have treated you cold and dogged you. And they may have did it over the years. But slowly but surely, I just can't keep stressing it enough. From all that hurt and pain and grief and neglect. I just want you to see where you are now so you appreciate it, my baby. I see you do. Definitely. This is you. You know, people walk this realm never even hitting on nothing nowhere near that. I just want to be mindful to you. You the one put in the work. You the one that got it out the mud day and night. What? What? Religiously, my baby. Fucking queen. You all four queens in one. You know what I'm saying? Never let anyone make you feel. I see you never happen. Clearly. Never let anyone make you feel less than the beautiful being and thing that you are. You know the unknown is key. Because you know who the lucky charm is. And you know each and every day is not no illusion. Who's running shit out here in this world. Right? It's beautiful, my baby. This is freaking awesome. I love you. Be still. <laughs> Follow the rainbow. And I see you are. I love you. I love you. I love you, my family member. I see the divine realm is adjusting your hem from your robes and your garments. And you're on your way, my baby. On your way. <laughs> Take care. Because care is taken with you. Love and light, I wish you everything beautiful, phenomenal. May abundance chase after you all the days of your life. Praises be to the Most High. Bye, my family.